Hi everyone, this is Zach. And this is Karen B. Today's topic is a bit different. It has nothing to do with what we usually do. Well, right now I am in the north of Morocco with my brother and his friend who discovered something very interesting and amazing. We want to share it with you with the hope that we will find someone who knows a place that is as crazy as this one so we can study it together. I think it's important. There are definitely more places like this one in the world. Well, we drove for like three hours in a dangerous world to get to this hill that is located in this isolated area. I can't tell you where the exact place is because we had no GPS signal at all, but it was in this area. We better tell NASA to put some satellites above this place because it looks like they forgot to put some here. Anyways. What's weird about this little hill is that when you are inside a car and you feel like you are going downhill and you stop the car at the end of the hill and you release the brakes, the car starts to go backwards, which means uphill. And that makes no sense at all. When my brother told me about it, I didn't believe it, so I had to go see it myself. And here I am, but to be honest, I still don't believe what I've seen, and I cannot say it's a lie either. There is definitely something wrong about this place, because I really could not explain what I have seen. I mean, we were five people in the car, and we really felt like we were going downhill. Anyone, anyone in any place in the world can tell if they are going downhill or uphill, right? So. This time, in that specific hill, we felt like we were going downhill. It wasn't just me. And yes, we all agreed that we were going downhill. Then my brother stopped the car and released the brakes. We started to go backwards or uphill. Then we got out of the car and suddenly we had more questions. Because the road looked like it was leveled. Not so leveled, of course, but it didn't look like we thought it would look like. Because we have already seen the road we came from, it was not like this. We repeated it many times. How could it be leveled? That was our first question. Then I started to move away from my people and they started to see me going uphill. And when I looked back at them, I saw them as if they were going uphill as well. It's just this crazy. So, so what, what does, does science, science say about, about this? this? These places are referred to as Gravity Hill or Magnetic Hill, Anti-Gravity Hill or Mystery Hill. These are places where objects that are able to move freely seem to roll or flow uphill. Likewise, it seems as if you need to exert more effort to go downhill. Water will seem to flow uphill and a car left in neutral will roll uphill. The laws of physics don't seem like they apply here. Many stories are told about these places such as mischievous actions, rotational pull, or a cosmic or magnetic vortex of unknown origin. So what is happening in these special locations? What seems to be happening is the perfect storm of optical illusions. The horizon could be obstructed, therefore you have no reference point to determine true level visually. Not being able to see the horizon can cause you to feel dizzy or disoriented. That's why when someone is seasick, they are told to look at the horizon. If the horizon is not obstructed, it could be that the background scenery is in contrast to the grade of the road, making it difficult to tell if the road is level or not. The natural surroundings can also trick your eye. Trees grow toward the sunlight and not always perpendicular to the ground. The combination of these things can easily create the optical illusion. When you witness something, your eyes and your brain try to make sense of it using your current surroundings. But if your surroundings are sending mixed messages, you will end up with an optical bias that is incorrect. You can try to figure out what is causing this phenomenon by using a long level to check the grade of the road. 
If you have a topographic map, you can see if the elevation is changing on the road and its surroundings. The best way is with a surveyor's tool, a theodolite, if you have access to one and the knowledge to use it. There are hundreds of gravity hills all over Earth. If you live near one or visit a place that has one, go there and record your experience. What happens there? What are the surroundings like? What do you feel when you are there? Well, I didn't take many videos because I really wasn't going to talk about it. Because I didn't know how to film it or how to prove what I was seeing. But my friends convinced me to make this video at least to let people know about this mystery spot. One of the videos that I shot was taken inside the car with my little brother. We put a spirit level above this door handle. We made sure it was leveled because the ground looked leveled as well. And then we started to go downhill and the spirit level started to show that we were really going downhill. So is it really just an optical illusion? It's really hard to say. I mean, if you are inside the car, you cannot say it's an optical illusion. And the spirit level has proven that we are not, or we were not on a leveled ground. Anyways, we stopped the car at the end of the hill and my brother released the brakes and look at the car it's moving backwards and it's speeding up i don't know how to explain this can you the spirit level is going back to its original position which was leveled please if you think that these mystery spots can lead us to something curious or if you can go to a place like this let us know there are many people who want to see more videos and more opinions about this. Please leave us a comment and let us know what you know. ZicoWorld123 at gmail.com Thanks for watching.